Hello team. Today, we released our fiscal Q1 financial results. Last quarter, we achieved 12.9 billion US dollars in group revenue with net income of 190 million on a now Hong Kong FRS basis. Despite a challenging market with unfavorable macroeconomic conditions. We continue to drive our innovation and transformation. And this focus has prepared us well to capture the long-term opportunities in digital and intelligent transformation. Last quarter, we saw further year-on-year -year increase in the percentage of our non-PC business to 41% in our group revenue, demonstrating strong momentum of our diversified growth engines. Our solutions and services business continued to deliver high profitability and strong growth. Managed services and project and solutions exceeded half of SSG revenue. In PCs, as we predicted the channel inventory digestion was completed last quarter, and we saw shipments and activations conversion. But the average unit revenue of PC was under pressure due to declining component price and intensified competition, and impacted our revenue. In fact, the entire client devices market is facing similar challenges, including smartphone and tablet markets. And we should be proud of the fact that we still maintain our number one global market share in PCs and achieved the highest Q1 activations for the last decade in smartphones, which leave more room to grow in the next couple of quarters. In infrastructure solutions business, due to the demand softness in cloud service provider, computer server, and other factors, we faced short-term challenges and had a slight decline in revenue last quarter. But we achieved strong growth in storage, high-performance computing, software, and services. Lenovo is now ranked number three in AI hardware infrastructure provider. Well, we delivered the hyper growth. Looking ahead, I'm cautiously optimistic for the remaining quarters this year. With the commodity, price, bottoming, and the activations improving, the device business should be on a path of recovery and the growth in the second half of the fiscal year. And in the long term, we have confidence to achieve sustainable growth and the profitability improvement. The reason the global excitement around the AI is driving AI applications and accelerating its adoption by all industries. It only proves our intelligent transformation is the right strategy. We will continue to develop AI devices, AI infrastructure, and AI-enabled solutions to help our customers improve productivity. For more details, I encourage you to turn in to Lenovo Tech World on October 24th. Team, in the current context, we must keep our expenses in line with revenue. A resilient expense to revenue ratio is critical for us to stay efficient and competitive. And I count on your support. Together, let's navigate the short-term challenges. Let's build a consistently profitable business, a growing global technology powerhouse ready to win for the long term. Thank you.